Hey guys, it's Joe. I hope everyone's doing great out there. Coming at you tonight with an unboxing video. And this one is from Lisa from Lisa Reviews. Now, if you guys don't know Lisa, um, I will link her channel down below. She does a lot of unboxing videos um, and uh, is a very uh, nice girl and a great YouTuber. So definitely go check out her channel, subscribe, show her some love. Uh, but I uh, was in contact with her because I was watching one of her videos and I commented on an item that she received that I thought was like really cool and I guess she wasn't as big of a fan of it um, so she offered it up to me and asked if I would like it and I said absolutely so um, it looks like she sent actually a few extra items so that is super nice of her so very excited to see uh, what she sent um, you know, you didn't have to send any extras, but I definitely appreciate it. And I'm really looking forward to the one item that uh, is going to be in here. But very excited to see what else we got in here. So let's open this box up. Not waste any more time here. Uh, but yeah, definitely go check out her channel, guys. Uh, super nice girl. She's uh, I met her through, um, you know, the uh, Your Average Techie group. So once again, guys, if you're not a member of the Your Average Techie group, I'll link it down below because everyone, especially, um, you know, fellow YouTubers should definitely be a member of that group because it really um, is good for promoting your channel uh, and everyone is super nice in that group and just uh, awesome people all around in that group and, uh, you know, you get a lot of info as well about uh, certain uh, items that are being released and stuff like that in the Funko community and pretty much anything else. So, all right, so it looks like there's a note on top here and everything is nicely wrapped here. So um, let's read it here. So, hey Joe, I really hope that you like the gifts I sent over for you. It really means a lot that you take the time to pay attention to everyone's channel and make the effort to interact. Of course, I mean this, you know, when I started my YouTube channel, I started it um, to meet fellow horror fans, but also, you know, the whole, you know, geeky, nerdy community that's out there. I mean, I love meeting not just horror fans, but, you know, I'm, you know, I'm not just all horror. I also love, you know, Batman and a lot of the other stuff in this community. So I love watching everyone's videos and I love interacting and communicating with everybody. Um, it means a lot to me because I am so new to all of this. I've sent some things I've noticed you said you liked and a few others too. You'll hopefully like too. Best wishes, Lisa. Uh, P.S. Seriously, good luck with the puzzle. So I guess that's a little spoiler. I guess I'm, there's going to be some sort of puzzle in here. But thank you for the note, uh, Lisa. That is super nice of you. And it's great to meet people, especially people from overseas because um, she is... Um, from Britain, I believe it is here. Um, she's definitely over from the UK somewhere, uh, but it's awesome to meet people from you know other countries. I mean, I think that is so cool, and I would have never met anybody from YouTube, never mind get a package uh, from someone over in the UK. So it's all thanks to you know YouTube and this amazing community um, of people. So I uh, love watching everyone in this community's video. Um, and it's just a hell of a lot of fun. So, all right, let's see what we got here. First item we'll open here. It feels like some, oh, this is super cool. Ha, <laughs> this is so cool. Now, as you guys know, I've always, you know, said that I am not a big fan of plushes, but I can make exceptions. And this one is awesome. And it is a Stay Puff Marshmallow Man plush. Like, this is like a perfect plush item because, you know, the Stay Puft Marshmallow Man is supposed to be, you know, like soft. And he is like a perfect uh, plush uh, figure there. So that is one plush that I am totally on board with. And that is super cool. He looks awesome. Uh, he's got a little, uh, you know, hanger here. So you can kind of, you know, display him nicely if you want uh, on like a tack or a nail or something there. But this is really, really cool. I really like this. And it's um, officially licensed because you can see it's got the Ghostbusters tags on it and everything. So that is super cool. I really love that. Very, very cool first item right there. All right, second item. Oh, all right. This is really cool here. This is 
a, wow, this is cool. I've never seen anything like this before. It is, and I think this is what she said when, good luck with this puzzle. It is a Dracula. Um, it, it looks like he can turn into almost like a Rubik's Cube in the back. It says, turn Dracula into a cube. So that is really interesting. So you, I, I mean, the he's really cool looking. And apparently you can turn him into almost like a Rubik's Cube looking thing from what it shows in the back there. So that is really interesting. Uh, an item I've really never seen before, and that is like really, really cool. So I'm definitely going to try to turn Dracula into a, cu a cube, I guess. But that is really, really cool. All right, next item here. Let's see what I can pull out here. I believe this is the item that um, she said she was going to send originally, and it is, yeah. This is super, super cool. So I am a very big Game of Thrones fan, and when I saw this, this is like really, really cool. It is a Hand of the King pin from Game of Thrones. Of course, if you watch the show, you know exactly what the Hand of the King is, but it's basically, you know, the king's right-hand man, and he wears um, the pin. It's, you know, been passed... The Hand of the King has changed hands a few times in, along the show there. But that is like super, super cool and a really awesome Game of Thrones item. Um, I'm actually starting to get, get a decent amount of Game of Thrones stuff. Like that's kind of becoming my second, after horror, kind of becoming my second most collectible uh, things that, that I have. Um, but yeah, Game of Thrones, awesome show. If you haven't seen Game of Thrones, guys, I can't recommend it enough fantastic show and uh yeah it's just fantastic and that is an awesome very awesome pin right there so that is very cool all right so it looks like we got a few other items in here um all right this i have no idea what it is but we'll open it up it's like some sort of uh face here on it but let's see if i can figure out how to open this here all right so I'm opening it and there's like half a body i think Maybe this goes to it too or something. I'm not sure. So it's like half a body of some sorts. I, oh, okay. I think like, yeah, like he must... I'm not familiar with the reference of the show or whatever, but he must turn... Yeah, so yeah, you can like, you kind of like turn him. That's pretty cool, actually. I like that. That's really cool. That's a cool little figure right there. Like his head, you know, it's like his body attached so it's just like a body and then this goes on to the head there this looks really familiar i don't i think it is from some show i do not know the show so you guys will have to help me out with that one because it looks really familiar so i'm sure that i you know once you guys tell me i'll know but i'm not a hundred percent on that right now so you guys will have to help me out with that all right next item here what do we got here oh very cool very very cool we got American Horror Story collector cards. That is super cool. I've never seen these before. I didn't even know these existed, but I'm a, I'm a pretty big fan of American Horror Story. I've watched every single season. Some seasons better than others. I would say my favorite season is definitely season one. These appear to be my favorite is season one, um, but you know, they've all been pretty solid. This, I'm seeing if, the, I'm trying to see if this is from a specific season or if it's all different. This looks like it is from, all. this looks like it's mainly from season one, but it looks like there's some other seasons mixed in here. But we'll show them to you real quick here. You get some, I'll show you a few anyway. Um, but these are very, very cool um, collector cards here. Make sure they're not back upside down for you, but very, very cool cards there. And it looks like there are, you know, stories on all of them. Okay, so the cards, it tells you what... So, yeah, it looks like these are all from Season 1 of American Horror Story, which I just said was my favorite season of American Horror Story. Um, of course, the Murder House season. And that is very cool. I've never seen collector cards from American Horror Story, so that is very interesting. I really, This is a really cool one. I like this one right here. Of course, the very iconic image from season one. I think it is anyway. You see that a lot with the rubber man and stuff. But Marion Hall Story has been pretty solid, I gotta say, overall as a, you know, as a series. So that is really cool. It looks like we got one more item in here, guys. And let's see what this is. This, I think, is going to be super cool. And it is. Absolutely is. This is amazing. 
It is. Is this a? Is this what I think it is? Or maybe I, it's not what I think it is. All right. At first, I thought. All right. It is a blood-soaked um, cloth. At first, I thought it was a pillowcase, but now I'm not so sure about that. Let me see if I can read this. I, I still don't. Is this a pillowcase? Maybe it's not. All right. I think it's just a cloth, if I'm not mistaken. But it has like the feeling of a pillowcase, so that's why I like. I'm like. Try and see if it opens, but I don't think it does. But this is still like really, really cool. And right up my alley, of course, you get the blood soaked hands there and just the blood splatter everywhere. Hell yeah. Um, I'm probably gonna end up just hanging this like on uh, out in the heart in the man in my man cave. Cause this is like really, really cool looking. I love this thing. This thing is super cool. Absolutely love this. I'm trying to read the tag here. Oh, it's from the UK too, so it's a UK. So it's, I think this is my first like overseas item uh, that I've gotten. But this is like super cool, right up my alley, of course. Uh, so super cool. So thank you so much, Lisa. Um, you didn't have to send anything extra, but I absolutely love everything you sent. And you know, I can tell you watch my videos because you know everything you sent is like right up my alley. Uh, and you know, this Stay Puff Marshmallow Man is friggin' awesome. I absolutely love that thing. And you know, the Hand of the Kingpin is amazing, but this blood splattered cloth here is friggin' so cool. It is super, super cool. It has like the feeling of a, um, you know, of like a sheet or a pillow, uh, a pillowcase. And that's what I originally thought. But you know what, maybe I could turn this like into a pillowcase and like put it over my pillow or something still. Cause this is like super awesome. I love this thing. That thing is really cool. Um, but that is it guys. Uh, definitely go check out Lisa once again from Lisa Reviews. I will link her channel down below guys. Go show her some love, subscribe to her. She's super awesome, super nice girl. Um, so go give her some love guys. So that is it guys. Let me know what your favorite item was that uh, was sent in this box. And that is it. So I hope everyone has a great night, and we'll see you all real soon.